morning, Miss Watson. Morning, everybody. Morning, Mum and Dad. <laughs> Mr Higgins has just come to say hello. We're in school this morning for assembly. Say hello if you've logged on. Hi, Connor, Grace and Summer. Hi, Miss Sherry. <coughs> Hi, Isla. Morning, Rebecca. Morning, Isabel. Morning, Rose and Mr Yates. Morning, Mr Moody. Morning, Brooke. Hi, Mrs Layla. Josh, Amy and Emily. Hi, Eva. Hi, Lawrence and Ralph and Ted. Morning, James. Morning, Mrs Davis. Hi, Ella. Hi, Ellie Mae. Hi, Joseph. Hi, Meg. Oh no, someone can't hear me. Hi, morning, Mr. Parker. Can you just let me know if you can hear me, somebody? If you could just message me to let me know if you can hear me, okay? Hi, Amelia. Hi, Ronnie and Rowan. Hi, Poppy and Riley. Morning, Lauren. Hi, Annie. Hi, Imogen and Amy. Hi, Jessie. Hi, Jacob. Hi, Liam. Please, could someone just message and let me know if you can hear me? I can hear you. Oh, yeah, thank you, that's great. <laughs> thank you, Mackenzie. Brilliant, thank you, everyone can hear me, which is great. Morning, Mr. Rotherham. Hi, Kieran. Morning, Quinton. Hi, Jack. Hi, Alexis. Good morning. Morning, Fergus. Morning, Mrs. Wood. Brilliant. Thank you, everybody. Confirming you can hear me, which is great. Thank you. Morning, Jack. Thank you. Morning, Harriet. Morning, Emily. Morning, James. Morning, Karis. Morning, Elsa. Hi, Oliver. Morning, Blaine. Morning, Alex. Morning, Ruby. Morning, Alfie. Morning, James and George. Morning, Annie. Morning, Kezia and Gabby. Morning, Adam. Absolutely, Mrs. Dixon, it is your cup of tea time. Morning, Steph. Morning, Connie and Stan. <coughs> Morning, Edward. Morning, Francesca. Okay, I'm going to give it another minute and then we'll make a start. Just let anyone else join us who is needing to this morning. Hi, Olivia. Hi Ryan, morning.
Morning, Leo. Morning, George. Morning, Finley. Morning, Mrs. Kaczynska. Okay, I think we'll make a start. Let's just check the time. Yeah, we'll make a start now. Okay, good morning, everybody. Uh, this is our first assembly back of the summer term. So parents, uh, go and make yourselves a cup of tea. Hopefully, it'll take about 20 minutes, maybe half an hour. So leave your children in my capable hands and go and have yourself a break, a cup of tea and a biscuit, much well deserved. Uh, I am back in school today. As you can see, I'm in the hall in front of our learning tree. And I do have, uh, let me see if I can turn my camera around. I do have a live audience today. They're a very small live audience, but critical work children, just give us a wave. And Mrs. Henderson and Mrs. Yates. Fabulous. It's wonderful to have some live children. But also it's great to have you joining us at home as well. We miss you all loads. It's a very strange start to the summer term, but hoping we will see you all again very soon. So I just wanted to talk to you about something this morning that's really, really important in the world at the moment. And some of our critical worker children uh, are going to help me with that this morning. So they're going to do three short dramas for us. And while you're watching those dramas, I want you to think about something that is missing from what they say to each other. So have a think what is missing. So can I have Poppy and Josh first? Back, just go to the left a little bit, that's it. Perfect. <clears throat> Okay, thank you Poppy and Josh. Round of applause, please. Oh, it's a very quiet round of applause. Okay, so uh, can I have Leighton and Leo next? Big voices, boys. <clears throat> I'm just going off to the shop. Do you want me to buy you anything? Milk, bread and a chocolate bar. Excellent. Well done, boys. Big claps at home for the boys, please. And next. Can I have Dylan and Poppy? Okay, thank you, Dylan and Poppy. Round of applause for them. Okay, so we had three short dramas. Hopefully, you were able to hear the children. Did you notice, and you can comment at the bottom, did you notice anything that was missing in their conversations? So Josh had bought Poppy a tennis racket. Leighton offered to help Leo with some shopping. And Poppy held the door open for Dylan. But what was missing in their conversations? Oh, well done, Rebecca. You've spotted what was missing. Oh, yeah, well done, Amy and Josh. They spotted what was missing. What was missing about what the children said to each other? Well done, Holly and Jack. Well done, uh, Riley and Poppy. Well done, Leo. Well done, Alfie. Excellent. Well done, Jacob. Well done, Connie and Stan. Excellent, Rose. They did, indeed. They missed their manners. And most importantly, at the moment, they missed the word thank you, okay? Even at the most difficult times when we're all feeling the pressure, saying thank you is really, really important. Saying thank you shows that you value somebody. It brings out the best in people because they're more likely to want to carry on helping you. It draws people together and it shows that you are part of a team. Helping each other is so important at the moment. And if we don't use our manners, we can really discourage people from helping us. So even at this really tricky time, there's lots to be grateful for. Just in the comments, do you want to give me some of the things that you're thankful for at the moment? 
So what sorts of things should you be saying thank you for at the moment? Just pop them in the comments for me. Any ideas of things that you're thankful for at the moment, even though times are really tricky? Yeah, absolutely. James is really thankful for his devices so we can keep in touch with people. Brooke's really grateful for the NHS. Isabel's grateful for her birthday. Doctors, food, absolutely. More grateful for ever than our supplies. NHS and our families. Thank you, Mr. Moody. The weather, absolutely. The sunshine's made a world of difference. NHS, really important. I think we're all more grateful than ever for all our healthcare workers. Having a parent to help us and look after us, really important. All our key workers, having food and drink. Food, food's coming up a lot. It's a popular one to be grateful for. Yeah, Liam said the NHS, really important. Mrs Thomas has said the internet, keeping us in touch. Jacob says good health. Thanking our parents for doing their best for us. NHS, keeping our family safe. Thankful for our lovely homes that keep us safe. NHS. Summer, birthdays on Wednesday, well done summer. NHS, when it's very warm outside, we've got lovely weather to enjoy. Football teams. Wonderful. There's an awful lot to be really, really grateful for at the moment. Uh, and I quite agree with all of the things you said. And what I really want to remind you all to do is to say thank you. Because it's really important that we pull together as a team at the moment, encourage each other to help each other. And by using our manners, it can make a real difference to doing that. What I want to ask you all to do is... Uh, on our and lots of places around our community and around our town are doing this at the moment outside the Victorian block we've got some iron fencing iron railings and any of you who are on your daily walk who want to bring something to attach to those railings as a sort of symbol as your thanks that would be brilliant so it could be a piece of colorful ribbon it could be a decoration that you've made maybe a hanging rainbow something that brings some color to our community and it shows that newport genius school are grateful for all the things we still have in our world it would be fabulous so i'm going to put it out on the website later but anything you can bring along as a message of thanks would be brilliant um, please remember though to only do it as part of your daily walk and to remember your social distancing rules as you do it as well um, I want to say a massive thank you while I'm in our first assembly to our wonderful Newport Junior School team. The staff at Newport Junior School managed to keep our school open over the Easter holidays and they are working extremely hard behind the scenes to try and communicate, share things with you and keep our school family close together. So a massive thank you from me to our Newport Junior School team. If you haven't seen it yet, their latest project was our Grease Megamix film. So if you haven't seen it yet, it's on our YouTube YouTube channel and that just goes to show the commitment to you and how much they are missing you as well okay I'm going to do a song now uh, I'm hoping to be able to flip my camera so you should be able to read the words the right way around this time it's a popular one from assemblies it is a worship one uh, join in at home children standing up singing and dancing along we're going to do um, if I were
today. Hopefully you enjoyed a good sing-along at home. Uh, hopefully the children enjoyed reminders of one of their favourite songs, okay? Uh, I'm going to do something a little bit different now because along the lines of being thankful for things, uh, we've got something very exciting um, in school to look forward to that really should officially have opened this week. Uh, some of the contractors, unfortunately, um, are not able to get into work, so some things aren't quite in place. But I wanted to show you this morning, I'm not sure I'm supposed to, so keep it between us. Uh, I wanted to show you this morning our new extension. Um, and I think there might be some people in the extension who are very pleased to see you this morning. So I'm hoping this will work. I'm going to turn the camera around now because rather than seeing me, there are far more exciting things to see. So uh, this is the front of the hall. And now to the side of the hall, we have some brand new doors. I'm going to take you through those doors now so that children, you can see what we have to look forward to in our new extension. <clears throat> so you can see that they haven't quite finished the tarmacking outside. Okay. I'm going to go through here. And to the left here, we oh. have our brand new... Oh, look! Hello, Ray. Morning, Mr. Higgins. Our lovely new disabled toilet, looking very good. Okay, so we have our disabled toilet facility. Notice the flash of pink. I can't imagine who chose that. Through here, we have our boys' toilets with a nice flash of green there. Okay. And then I'm just going to come back out. I'm going quite slowly. And I'm going to go through here now into the girls' toilets here. So if you've got any suggestions for me, please comment and keep checking the Facebook page for updates on Everyone, see you later. Thank you, Mr. This. Parker. Bye. Thank you. Okay, so I'm coming back down the corridor. Through another session. Uh, okay, I think I lost you for a minute. Can you just confirm if you've got me back? Okay. Can you just let me know if you can see me again? Yeah, someone's telling me I'm back. I think it was the excitement of seeing Mr. Parker. Just let me know if you think I'm back. It's telling me I'm live, so if you just let me know if you can see me and hear me. Let me know if you think I'm back. Just let me know if you can see me. Anyone comment if it's still working? Miss Hardy, is it working? No, okay. Hmm? I'm back. I think so. Anyone I'm back, apparently. Some people are saying I'm back. Okay. 
Hello. <laughs> I didn't realise I was on. <laughs> Apparently I'm back, yes. Wonderful. Right, I'm going to try and go a little bit further. If it doesn't work, I will go back to the hall. Um, it's possibly because um, internet's a little bit intermittent. Miss Hardy tells me I'm working. Okay, so I'm just going to show you now, hopefully, uh, the classroom. So this is an example of the classroom. It's not finished. We have no furniture. But you can see there, sinks, drawer units, display boards. Oh, and look! Mrs Yates! Trying to get everything all nice and lovely. I'll go back in the corridor. There's Mrs Yates, cleaning away. And new smart boards and things. And then there's another classroom down the corridor and a store cupboard. Okay. Best in the corridors only, don't you? Yeah, I'm going to head back to the hall now. I'll just show you down again here. Okay, we're heading back to the hall. I'll turn the camera around so hopefully you can see me. I'll go back and forth quite quickly. Okay, I'm really sorry for anyone who lost me at any point. Um, I hope you got a good taste or a little sample of the extension. Hopefully if I save the film at the end, I'll upload it to our YouTube channel. So if it was your internet rather than mine, then hopefully you can catch up and see the bits that you missed and have another good look as well. Uh, really exciting though, lots of things to be grateful for, lots of things to look forward to. So please keep positive even though times are tricky. Uh, just a couple of messages um, from me before we finish. Um, just remember Miss Watson every morning is um, doing her maths on Facebook Live at 10 o'clock. Uh, Miss Hardy is reading every day at half past five on Facebook Live. That starts again today. Uh, Mr Parker will be doing some reading as well. More information about times and dates to follow. Um, Golden Roll and our Grease Mega Mix videos are all on our YouTube channel and Facebook page. So again, if your children are missing us, it's a good opportunity to talk through uh, who we all are and what we're doing and just keep in touch with our faces. Um, and Home Learning is back. So again, on your, um, on your website, on your class pages, every day you'll find your learning activities that the staff are suggesting for you to do that day. Uh, most importantly, just to remind you, we miss you loads, okay? We can't wait to have our school family back together, but at the moment we're doing what we have to do. We're doing the right thing, not the easy thing, and we are staying safe. So please continue to look after yourselves. Please continue to stay in touch. And thank you to everybody in our school family for all of their support. We really do appreciate it. Uh, I'll be back soon uh, for another assembly. Uh, date and time to be confirmed. I will make sure um, the message gets out there. Thank you all, lovely to see you. <clears throat>